tracing to it. So if we just say place or uh, adding select would be harder, but should be doable. I can definitely uh, place place down. I mean, usually when I'm doing this stuff, it's just because I want to fill a hole or something. So I don't really care what it has selected. Or I can you know, put what I want in the slot it has selected. Total worthwhile. Man. I don't know if anybody else feels is, is pleased when they think of something like this. But if you can't tell, I'm mighty pleased. Mighty pleased. Um, yeah, just you can't use any numbers with these ones, but I mean it's, uh, it's such a such a small limitation. Um, mm -mm. Okay, so now we're at the point where. Klaus, Mr. Klaus here, is going to need to get some water. Now, selecting stuff would be useful. Yeah, definitely. Okay, let's let's try to squeeze that in there because that's like this thing already refuels automatically, right? Um, no, it doesn't actually automatically refuel, huh? Well, that's okay. Um, so actually, I'm not gonna bother editing it, but I mean, if you wanted to change it, so it'd be like, you could change the whole program from go to do, so it'd be like do, and then it would be command and repeat. I mean, it's still a really well, a really nicely structured program. It's, I mean, it's, it's versatile enough that I'm just literally throwing additional parameters into it, and it works. Um, now, the only thing is, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. Select equals. Turtle. Actually, maybe I don't need to add that as a parameter. Because what I need to do. Um, so. Return. Return. And. No, no, I, I did. I want. I do want that there. Turtle select. So then, after the select, the number you would enter would be the that x exists. So then, right here, I'm going to do modification to this program. If That's so. If handler, um, I think I can just internal select, select. Mm -mm. And then the distance. And and distance. Less than or equal to sixteen. And and distance greater than. Actually, no. I want to put that in there as error checking. Okay. Then else. And and so we're adding just a slight bit. So here, 
Um, yeah, this isn't the, the prettiest way to add it, but I, I just want to add it into the existing program with as little edit as possible. So if and distance is less than 1 or and distance greater than 16, then print invalid slot selection. Turn and okay, so here we go. Other than that, we would just then say, um, I actually I can have handler, you know, and distance. Sure, we can do that. So that should do it. Actually, I can select things now. So I can have a, a shorthand for writing temporary programs with this whole Go program. Uh, I guess I, I better check it out, make sure it works before I boast about how awesome what I did that doesn't work is. <laughs> so if I say go cell 5, forward 2, cell 2. Ooh, thunder snow, great. Alright, turn 2, forward 2. Sure, let's do that. Yeah, he's moving around, he's selecting slots. Did you see that? Oh man, this is gonna be a load off of my, a load of, of less work that I need to do. I'm still gonna pick him up to move him to the, that water though. <laughs> um, and I am mildly concerned about uh, mobs out here. But see now, I can do this. Give him a couple of buckets, so we say go forward, and then place down, sell to place down, back to, sure. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Doesn't like place, oh, I know why. Course. Same problem I had before. It doesn't return true, does it? Or something. Something along those lines. That's always a, an annoyance. I could have sworn it returns. Okay, like seriously, if I go in here, now if I say Lua not place down, false. Okay, what am I doing? I thought that's how it... Isn't it a place down to grab water? Place down with a bucket? Um, dig down? <laughs> yeah, it's true, even though... Yeah, it makes the breaking noise, even though it's just water. What? All right, well, this actually, uh, pleasantly, it hasn't happened in a while, but I'm going to have to look up bucket handling briefly. So um, I'll be back in, in mere moments for you. <laughs> Hey, I'm back, and if, <laughs> wow, I have to say, the moment when you pop over to the computer craft wiki, and you're over there, you're looking around, uh, you know, I j just, just brought it up, this is, I haven't even, uh, that, that break, what was that? It was just 20 seconds. I've just barely even pulled the wiki up before I even got a chance to look at anything. And I'm browsing, around, you know, browsing onto the wiki where I want to go. And all of a sudden, you just hear this, and there's the moment of confusion, and then there's the quickly followed by the moment of panic, <laughs> and then I hear the explosion, and then it's very much the moment of, oh crap, what blew up, and. Super thankfully, I was absolutely saved by my armor. So, uh, huge thank you to people suggesting that. Uh, 
Um, and then there's also just the element of dumb luck, wherein Klaus was standing over here and the creeper came from that direction. <laughs> So maybe I should pause the game the next time I decide to go browse the wiki. Um, at any rate, I still have... No, I haven't figured this problem out. So, oh, <laughs> a little bit of excitement there. <laughs> Just wanted to share that as it happened. Um, oh, now I got this damn big hole to fill in my tree farm area. Hmm. That can be handled. Yes, this is this is going to be bad with all this snow. Anyway, let's get back to the back to the task at hand. Oh, jeez. <sighs> I didn't even have a chance to say I was back. My god. <laughs> I really gotta get back inside my walls. <laughs> oh my gosh. The creepers are out to get me, man. I don't have... Where's the where's the creeper? I got some snowballs now. No more? Alright. Fine. Okay, well I'm pretty I came I was just coming back. Oh my gosh, so that's going to be a really interesting cut <laughs> there, but... <laughs> that's... Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I'm having some bad luck. Um, so I was just coming back to be like, oh, okay, I found it on the, the forums. There's... I don't know if it's a bug or what. Um, apparently... And... You have to be uh, a, a block above the water for it to work. So, two place down. Whoop, 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 string. Oh, I'm in Lua. So, all right, so go left turn up, place down, forward, so two place down. Yeah, look at that, see, there we go. No problemo, let me just do that to replenish it. And two full buckets. Piece of, piece of cake, piece of cake. Uh, just, um, I, ha I had heard that once before about needing to be a block above. It's just not something, just didn't remember, that's all. So now I've got two nice massive holes here to, God, was that another creeper? I'm getting paranoid. All right, let's get back inside. I don't even know what time it is, it's so dark. Jeez. <laughs> I'm, I'm getting unlucky, but at the same time, lucky, you know? Because that twice, twice within, like, four blocks of my turtle. That's that's just too close. Much, much too close. So I think I need some more chests here. I'm kind of running out of room. Hmm... I don't need that, don't need that. Um, oh, I got all this spruce wood. I don't want a flower. I really don't want a flower. That is... That is nowhere on my list of useful things. <laughs> for, for, for computer crafting. Alright, so let's go check out Sidekick. Still got my snowballs. Just in case. And no more diamonds. Great, great, great. Um, and where is he sitting that he... Yeah, he could actually do one more mining run in this row. That's awesome. Go for it. Um, yeah, so I'll... I got quite a, a bit more space that I can mine out here. But uh, you can see the area I have mined, it, it is beginning to stretch a bit. Stretch, stretch for a ways. And actually, it just something occurred to me here just now that maybe I should be putting Klaus to work as another mining turtle. I mean, that would be that would be you know like the the most efficient use, so that um, I can get more diamonds even faster. But 
that then I'm kind of just stuck sitting around waiting again. It's not real interesting for anybody. Okay, yeah, that stacked it right that time. All right. Good to know. Some gravel in there, and it's full. Of course. So, let's go ahead and just craft a bunch of chests. Cause I've I got junk coming out of my coming out of my ears here. Uh, yeah. Okay, that was weird. Thought I screwed up for a sec. And put another one there. And no, nah, I'll do that. I've been seeing a lot of stuff about the uh, trap chests and stuff, so I. Get, looking forward to the idea of putting things next to each other. Now, this is becoming the wall of chests. I guess I should make this into an actual building, maybe, with a roof. Might be a good idea. Um, but I'll just throw that up there. And then let's go ahead and make that cobble. And, and dirt. Why not? Well, I, I need my dirt for now. Two, two, uh, um, and then you, 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 you're useful. Lapis, not useful. I haven't seen any lapis in a while either, actually. Uh, I got my good old creeper paranoia back, if you hadn't noticed. <laughs> uh, you're useful for sure. You are, you are. And, oh, Builder is in there. Forgot about him. Bones, and that's, that looks like about all useful stuff. So let's put useful stuff over here. Diamond, redstone, slime ball, mildly useful if I build a piston or something. Seeds would be useful. A turtle is useful. <laughs> um, oh, I didn't have any smooth in here. I don't think I was keeping any in there. All right. And we got a couple of, oh, torch. A couple of books, okay, cool, cool. Uh, coming around to daytime, roughly? Yeah. Got like a, a staircase here. Oh, there's zombies all over my area down there. Man. Just the... So many mob inhabitants. This has not been an especially... <laughs> again. Um, I mean, last time it wasn't... Wasn't too, this bad, I guess. But this has not been an especially productive... Uh, set of episodes in, in large part thanks to creepers at least i didn't die though that iron armor oh there's another creeper i just saw him snowball hey there creeper creepers creeping Ooh, way short Come on. Now nah, those trees are in the way. Hmm. All right, well, that's more or less daytime, but because it's so, you know, I better make myself another sword before I forget. And I'm out there, like, you know, what, what do you expect to happen? Fighting a skeleton or a creeper or something, and my sword breaks. That's how it would go.